Hey guys, this is Dodoid. So today for the Advent Calendar, I wanted to make a video about my Apple iMac G4. Unfortunately, I realized when I went to set it up that as this is a dumpster dive machine, I do not have an admin account. So instead of taking a look at the hardware in general today, uh, today I'm going to be going over how to effectively hack into an iMac G4. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to hold Command S on the keyboard and we're going to turn on the machine. So reach around to the back, hit the power button, and it should come on. There's the chime, and the Apple logo should come up, very briefly. All right, gray screen, there's our logo, and there's single user mode. So this is single user mode, and this is effectively how we're going to get into the iMac. So first we have to mount the file system in single user mode so that we can make changes to the file we need. So we're going to type slash sbin slash mount slash no sp space dash uw space slash. There we go, we've mounted. Now we're going to type rm, so that's remove, slash var slash db slash dot Apple setup done. Now we're going to press enter. That, that completes successfully. And now we're going to reboot. This time we will not press command S. We're booting to normal Mac OS. And the Mac should now reboot. So Mac OS has come up. And you will see that the way we've gotten in is by effectively telling the iMac that it's brand new. So, it's going to welcome us to Mac OS. All right, your keyboard cannot be identified. Uh, I guess we'll click OK. Uh, press the key immediate to the, immediately to the right of the shift key. OK. OK. Uh, I think that's it. OK, I'm in Canada. Continue. Uh, do not transfer my information. I do, I, I do have other Macs, but I'm not doing it. Uh, let's see, Canadian, let's choose US for keyboard. How do I connect to the internet, ethernet? Um, let's just leave that at default. All right, I don't really want to enter my Apple ID. Uh... I don't really want to enter any of this, but apparently I have to. I'll be back in a sec. All right, now we've gotten past that, so we should be able to say, I don't know, home? What describes you best? Video? I don't know. Uh, no thanks to that. And continue. Ah, good, finally, create your account. All right, so, uh, sure, Dorade iMac is fine. Don't need a password, not exactly secure. Uh, yeah, I don't want a password. All right, let's create the account, and we should be in. Connecting to Apple. You, you don't have any internet there, iMac. Don't see how you can. All right, time zone. That is correct. Uh, yep, that's correct. Great, okay, done. It took longer than I expected. Okay, we have a blue background and a mouse cursor. I am, yep, background. All right, we are in Mac OS. So we should, if we go to system preferences and accounts, we are administrator. All right, so maybe this will be a two-part video now because I still do want to show you around the iMac, but this was a bit of a 
interesting, albeit unprecedented, video. Um, so that is today's video, just showing you basically how to get into an old Mac, and I don't know if this works on new ones as well. I think it does if there's no firmware password, but I haven't tried it. Um, this is effectively showing you how to get into an old Mac if you're not admin. So I guess the other part's coming tomorrow. Bye. <laughs>